didn't do this stuff. This is not me, y'all. I'm fighting for my life. Y'all killing me with this. We got him. EDP 445. Step your ass to the congregation. I don't understand niggas. Y'all Gucci, y'all good in life, man. You in a good position. Motherfuckers doing a 9 to 5 while your ass on the internet doing your videos and making a living. Some people down on their low, some people homeless. But there's just niggas like you that want to fuck up your position. What is this? Bro, that... Hey, if you don't know what happened... Listen, hold on. Let me get my bullshit out of the way. Hey, what's up, Sam? It's K. What's up, what's up, what's up, what's happening? Gutter mob, we strong in this bitch, we like a navy. K show gutty shit with a cut up patron, I want to turn. And we here to talk about this F ass nigga, EDP, and the stupid fuckery this nigga has done. Honestly, I'm gonna just give you my like opinion and response to the bullshit he does and tell you to what the fuck happened. If you want more in depth, there's a lot of niggas that did more in depth. I ain't gonna put no text messages on here because I ain't want y'all to see that shit. If y'all wanna go look for it, go ahead. I'm going to tell you the bare, not the bare bones, I'm going to tell you what happened. But if you just want the physical proof of him doing that shit, go to other videos. You can probably find it on social media. Do your thing. But anyways, yeah, last subscribe to all that shit. But anyways, let's get in here. EDP. What the fuck? Like, why is there niggas like you and R. Kelly that exist? I know R. Kelly is an extreme. But y'all good. Y'all could get any woman y'all want. And there is beautiful women your age. By the way, the dude in the video is like, you kind of have a fucked up life, but you can find a girl that would love you. Listen, my nigga fat, dog. A skinny chick could like him. Don't do that. You disrespectful for that on my mama. But anyways, you can find a beautiful woman that likes you for how you are. Maybe they're clout chase or whatever. I don't know why you chasing after these little girls. Now I get it, YouTube. A lot of your fans probably going to be kids or whatever the fuck. That's cool, whatever. But you like an influencer. You can find a shorty that's around your age. At least legal. But, like, you going up to, like, what, a 13 year old? You be talking to a couple of that. Like, what? And, and then this is the thing. Like, I know he be joking in his videos. He talks very vulgar. But, like, yeah. <laughs> when you go back to the other videos after all this information, you're like, oh, you sick bastard. What the fuck? It's, just, it's ridiculous. It's honestly ridiculous. If you don't know, basically some dude, hold on, let me pull up his YouTube channel so I can tell you. If you want to watch that original video, and I'll probably put the link in the description. It's Chet Goldstein, and his, his video is a famous YouTuber, EDP455, caught meeting 13-year-old girl, featuring, I guess that's his homie, or whoever the fuck he's featuring, I don't give a fuck. But anyways, that happened. And it's just crazy. What? Like, for real? He tried to play it off. Like, oh, we're just friends. We're just friends. Like, you know, I, I was nothing sexual. No, we're going to get friends. We're going to go for a little nibble. Huh? Bro, no, nah, that's nigga. Yo, nigga, yo, motherfuckers should watch niggas like you. And I saw that motherfucker got so many guns. I, yo, I thought he was going to, when he's like, yo, please don't put this up, man. Like, let's stop. I thought, yo, he was hiding a gun in one of his belly rolls and was going to shoot one of these white boys. I was, bro, I was just running. By the way, I've been hearing some shit about this Chet Goldstein nigga that he a predator too, so, hey. <laughs> it's hilarious that one, that if he is a predator, kind a predator. Fucking hilarious. Bro, it is crazy. Like, why? I don't understand what goes on in, in guys' minds. And there's not, like, I know there's a majority of guys do this shit, but, hey, there's some women that like young kids as well, or... Well, fuck a young kid. Whatever the fuck. But anyways. I don't know what goes on in their minds that is like. Yes. Like a young person. That's what I like. That's what I never understood. Especially with the R. Kelly situation. Why? When there's beauty. Look at all the fucking uh, uh, fuck sweeties and make the stallions out here. The fucking Ariana Grande. Well, she fucking looks like a teenager. But I digress. You know <laughs> You know, all these other women out here. And your ass is caught up over a girl in high school. Why? Again, if it's that shit, like, it's different. Like, if this man is, like, a middle-aged man. Like, it's different if he was, like, Carson. Carson's, like, what? 19, right? If the girl's in high school and she's 17 and he's 19. That's like, all right, bro. That's, like, two years. Whatever the fuck. Yeah, you a famous YouTuber. You're, like, an adult. So like, cause 
18 or like an adult or whatever the fuck. You're still a fucking teenager. This is a teenager. She's 17. You 19. That's okay. But like, this motherfucker like 30 something. So, oh yeah, I like some little kid. Like, why? Why? And why talk to fat? See, I remember DJ Academics used to say this shit and I always laugh at him when he used to say this shit because I would be confused. But he would always be like, he would t start talking to a girl. He would always talk to a girl. Show me your ID. And at this point, he's right. Because you can't be doing this shit. Because he tries to say, oh, I was talking to her. I didn't even know her age. Yet. We were just having a good conversation. And I'm just like, but you found out and you still went. That's slimy. Listen, I'm not telling you to be like, oh, you are 35, date a 35 year old. But you couldn't find somebody at least over at the age of 18. Or at least 18. Was it that difficult? Come on, bro. Come on, nigga. Biggie had faith, Evans. Come on. Biggie was a big nigga, too. Come on now. Now you just look obese. Like you should be on my 600 pound life, but that's a story for another day. But oh my lord. Like, why? 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 Like, who would do that? Like, bro, he was very graphic. Yo, he was graphic as fuck in those text messages, too. Gra bro, I was just like, I was just astounded. It's like literally R. Kelly with his fucking tape recordings. You wanted to get caught. Because if you weren't, this... I'm, oh my god. I, I just don't know. I never really watched bro content like that. I knew he was funny. I seen a couple things here and there. He's a funny dude. He was like, hey, I had a problem with bro. Bro did his shit. He was cool. But did... <sighs> like, why, bro? Why? Why, why, why? It's just... Because, see, this is the thing, right? I would give him the benefit of the doubt. Because this is the first extreme. But the thing is, yo. This has been going on. A lot of people been saying, oh, bro, bro, be doing all this shit, bro. Be, your name been coming up with this predator shit a lot. So now when this shit actually happens... Bro, also, with you coming out when they are recording you, is my career over? Bro, come on. Yo, bro, bro, bro. You did some shit, nigga. You did some shit. You did some shit. I ain't got nothing to say. You did some... Like, what the fuck is this? Like, what is this? Honest, go check out the video. They was talking to that motherfucker too long, though. They was trying to get their shit out. They wanted a long video. I understand. You wanted people to watch this shit. That's cool. Y'all was trying to get your shit off. But, like, bro. Nah, my G. Nah, my G. Nah, my G. Hey, listen. Your demise will be televised. Or not even televised, but it will be on the YouTube screen. It will be televised for all to see. Bro, like, what the fuck? Like, what was going on in this? Like, how do people get there? Like, that's just nasty. In the like, why? Like, I... Un it like, why? You don't... See, yo... Sir, Mr. EDP, life has changed. You don't have to be the pretty boy to get a, 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 a girl, a good-looking girl. You could be an ugly nigga. It's fine. It ain't that difficult. What are you doing? Oh, my Lord, bro. I, I... Now, what do you say to this man? Like, God. God, bro. See, nigga, he probably the reason they made this Kepo rule on YouTube because all this bullshit his ass be doing. But anyways, I can't cuss and shit because of your domain. I'm joking. I'm joking. Let me chill with that. Let me chill with that. But it's just disturbing and it's weird. Like, you like to believe the good in all these people. And see, that's my thing with YouTubers, though. Listen, I fuck with a lot of y'all YouTubers. I watch y'all. I enjoy y'all content. But just because I enjoy your content doesn't mean y'all good people. Not good people, but y'all ain't gonna be, like, a person I might gel with. And I'm sure everybody has their bad deal, whatever the fuck, right? But, like, you might not be who you portray or say to me in your videos. So I just take your shit at face value. Cool. Hey, this, this video nice. I like your content. I'm gonna keep watching. You know what I'm saying? It's whatever. I might meet your ass in real life. You a whole ass nigga. I'm like, man, fuck this bitch ass nigga. You know what I'm saying? I don't give a fuck. I'll, th I'll say it like it is. You a whole ass motherfucker. I don't give a fuck. You know what it is? 
it is what it is. I just try to keep it a book with my people, you know what I'm saying? Of course, like, you might meet me, I'm going I'm to talk to you very politely and, and I'm saying my words because you ain't come from that club. I ain't going to come slur at you like, hey, what's up, I have any cat, hey, because y'all ain't going to know what the fuck I'm saying and then y'all ain't from that club. And then, uh, hey, where I stay at, there might be certain slang and terminology that you might not associate with, so you'll just be like, what the fuck is he saying? So I'm going to just talk to you bare bones. But besides that, yeah, the, the person is still me. Like, what is this, bro? It's just when you go back to the other videos and he's very vulgar, you're like, ugh. Like, yeah, like, ugh. What? Ugh. Disturbing young man. Oh, disgusting. Like, that's all it basically is. I, I don't know what to say. I don't know what to say. And it is what it is. You fucked up. Your career done. If you were supporting your family members, they done. If you show them on your screen or your Instagram, they're going to get ridiculed. We see what the fuck happened with Nicki Minaj and her brother. Motherfuckers be talking shit about her. Motherfuckers was happy she he passed. Or you got you got all that time in jail, whatever happened with that. You know what I'm saying? I'm sorry. I, I, I misconstrued like her other family member for passing the fuck, brother. I think he got locked for life or whatever the fuck. But nah, bro. Nah, bro. This is just sick and disgusting. See, there's fuckery in the YouTube community. That's all I tell y'all, man. I'm mostly hip hop. I'm gonna see you talking about the YouTube effery in here. I ain't gonna care. I ain't even gonna care. It's what it is. You disgusting, man. You disgusting, man. Like, again, if you're 35 and you dating a fucking 22 year old, no qualms. Do your thing. Shawty Lee, because she know what she's doing. Do your thing. But, like, a fucking team. Like, is you grooming? You want some Onision shit? Like, what the fuck is you doing? Bro, listen, that's all I got to say, nigga. Your, your demise will be televised. Nigga, I wish you ill, Ill will. I don't give a fuck, bro. I'm sorry. I don't give a fuck about you like that. I never watch your content like that, so don't care. I'm just going to say my shit, nigga. You a disgusting ass motherfucker. I ain't going to be politically correct or whatever the fuck, bro. I'm going to just say it from my chest. You a dumbass, stupid ass motherfucker. And also, you got to look into this motherfucker who shot the video because allegedly you got some predator. Predator vibes and your ass a racist, so off rip, I ain't fuck with your dumb ass. Your name Goldstein too, so off rip, I'm like, yeah, you don't like niggas. <laughs> okay, let me chill. Let me, let me chill. Let me chill. But I, 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 I'm off of this thing. This motherfucker disgusting as fuck. If you haven't heard of him, good. Don't search him. Y'all might search him up just to know what the fuck he did. I told you. Wait, do what you will. Do what you will. I give you warning, but do what you will. But anyways, I'm off of this thing. Hey, if you like anything I'd say. Like I said, I mostly do music, so don't expect this energy all the time, but I cover some YouTube fuckery. But anyways, I'm out for this line. Shlam, Zoom, peace, y'all. L's gang. I.